Hello, Nintendo Chit Chatters. I'm Eddie Ray for NintendoChitChat.com. Welcome to more preview coverage of Cold Sept Revolt on Nintendo 3DS. Shoutouts to NIS America for providing me a copy of the game. Last preview episode, we finished up my favorite cards uh, in our preview coverage. So we're diving back into today, guys. Again, in the quest area here. This is the Rebels. This is the next campaign after the main tutorial kind of mode. Um, a story mode. Uh, so my favorite cards was finished up last episode. So let's go over here to Day of Fate. The map was a simple branch. Again, the total magic goal here is 8,000. Uh, we do have some um, GP here, 1,600 from winning that last round, in addition to what we had left over. So we could buy some new decks. But uh, for now, we're going to stick with what we have. We're going to Day of Fate here. All right. We choose our Majestic Book. Match start. We can choose that here. There we go. So make sure you guys blast the like button for me. Comment below and subscribe. And here we go. Is that, uh... What's wrong? You can't sleep? Eddie... Yeah, I guess so. It's Alicia. So how are you, Eddie? Have you, been able to, have you been able to get to know everyone? It's only been a few days since I've been here. It isn't that easy. I see. Yes, I suppose you're right. What are you doing here? I was looking at the city, lit up so brightly by magic lanterns. At first sight, it may seem beautiful, but the brightness is fake. This place is a hell, created by the Count. The real world is on the other side of that wall. Only a little bit longer before we no longer have to see this cursed city. Yeah, the day to start the journey is near. Say, Eddie, what sort of life do you want to live once we get to the sacred city? You won't need to be occupied with battle. You can become a merchant or a craftsman. You can even be a farmer. Any of the paths will be difficult, but no one will be looking to take your life. That's more than enough, isn't it? You're right, as long as we're alive. It's almost time to take the first step to our dreams, Eddie. Your memory will come back, I'm sure. It's going to be a very difficult journey, but let's overcome it together. Yeah, only a few more days until the Star Festival. Hey, Alicia. Hmm, what is it? It's nothing, just... I hope you find your happiness. And everyone else here, too. Yes, Eddie, you too. We're getting along! Another challenge here, it looks like. It's finally begun, the Star Festival! Yes, Psyche, has the scouting all been done? Yes, the only subject that's guarding the gate of Crania is... Terramir's underling, Nighthawk. I see, just Nighthawk. As we predicted, security's light. Terramir, Nighthawk, who are they? Terramir is an upper scepter in the Count's army. He's something like a knight captain who leads the Count's army. He's incredibly powerful. He's an opponent that we, can, we can't defeat, even with all of us put together, but his underling, Nighthawk, is lower ranked. He was originally a drifter in the city, but he became afraid of the Count and started serving him. Usually there are a number of much higher ranked scepters at the gate. Today is definitely the perfect chance. So if we defeat the Nighthawk guy, we can get out of the city? But Alicia, you, will you be okay alone? I can come with you, just in case. Oh, thank you, Eddie. There's no need to worry. Who do you think I am? If I were afraid to be of someone like Nighthawk, I wouldn't be a good leader of the Freebats. That's right. We have tons of things to do before we worry about Alicia. All right, everyone ready? I'm going to explain the plan, so listen carefully. First, I'm going to head to the gate, and I'll defeat Nighthawk. Then, as a signal, I'll send this card here. Remember this picture. Okay. What is that card? Wind of Hope, the card of hope. This plan is our last hope. That's what it means. Yes, that's why it shows this card. When this card appears in the room, come to the gate quickly, all right? Yeah, I understand the plan, but why don't we all go together in the first place? It seemed like we had a better chance of success. Alicia wants to make sure that Jen and Yuma stay safe, Eddie. She wants to eliminate any chance of danger beforehand. I see. All right, so keep in mind that card and gotta head for the gates on the board. All right, well, I'll let go. I'll I'll get going now. Whatever you do, don't miss the signal. 
I'll try to clear the way as fast as possible, so wait just a little. I'll leave this place for you. Alright, I wish you luck. It's on. Alright, so once we see that card, we're gonna head for the gates. So, Eddie... Yuma. What shall we do until we hear from Alicia? No idea. Huh, why doesn't Yuma ever talk to you, Eddie? You've been with us for a while now, so I'm not really sure what the problem is. Hey, Eddie, let's have a battle. Well, just I should train, so I'm not gonna lose. A battle with Jen? Is this really the time? Don't say that, please, Eddie. Be his opponent. Jen is small, but he's a member of the Free Bats. We have to teach him to be strong enough to protect himself. All right, if you say so. Wait, if you're going to fight, then I'll fight too. Hmm, Yuma, why all of a sudden? It won't be good if Jen gets hurt. So I'm going to participate, to make sure. Okay, so it'll be a three-person battle, is that okay? I'm fine with that. I won't lose to Yuma either. I thought Jen at first was a girl, it's actually a boy. I don't care either way. Then it's decided, a three-way match between Eddie, Jen, and Yuma. It'll be a little warm up before the escape plan. Ready and begin. So a three-player battle. All right. This colorful land is a multi-element land. Oh, cool. Land gave a land effect bonus to creature of any element, but it does not make chains at all. So maybe it's better to use terrain change. Interesting. It's your turn. All right. Three-way battle here. Skeleton creature. All right. So we're gonna use. Oh yeah. We're gonna choose um... one. I guess we'll give it to Jen here, so we get a one roll. <laughs> Alright. So this way, we have nothing. I won't let you do anything bad to Jen. Okay? I won't. Statue creature. Twelve. Advance to the next gate. That's a big roll. Already. <clears throat> Alright, they really have nothing. We can put a statue creature there, I guess, on the water. Come on, both of you. Ah, there's your dice roll set to one! Ooh. You're using a spell card already on, um, <laughs> on Yuma's creature. Down to 30, look like. Alright, so they can put the Fulgust in there. Or a skeleton. It's your turn. Alright, ooh, a red work. Alrighty. So we can do, uh, ooh, user uses three dice for the next roll. Let's do that. Fly. Here we go. Three dice. Not bad. Advance to the next gate. <sighs> we put the skeleton creature here. Eddie, don't have to worry about me so much. Really. Long sword. Nine. The final gift awaits you. They have the uh, green orb they can summon there on the green land. All right, so we got some land being taken up already. Hmm. How do they catch up so much? Well, it's really, really on. Minutes are big roll here for them. Looks like. Oh no! I'm gonna put a minotaur there. It's your right. turn. Ooh, a woodfall creature. Cool. I actually like those a lot. Uh, yeah, go this way. The final gate awaits you. So there's a couple of those multicolored tiles I see here, which is cool. We can, uh, 
uh, level up the land over here. Actually, we can exchange creature, yeah. And make this Woodfolk creature, who is the home right on this land. In the right place. Jen, can you, cut, can you even hate me? <laughs> Goblins. You and me are taking the lead. Good luck on your next journey. Level up and ready for the land. My lands grow ever stronger. My green org, level two, on his land. Who is Spectre? Those are pretty cool. Are they gonna put this on me? Yep. Spell on me. Holy word one. Oh, on Yuma. Okay, thank you. I thought they were gonna do the spell on me, but no. Advance to the left. next gate. Enough of those gate bonuses for you guys. It's your turn. <clears throat> All right, uh, screen. We got plenty of screens. You've earned a reward. Good luck on your next journey. We can level him up, it looks like. Land. Uh, My lands grow ever two. stronger. Don't want to spend too much right now. Nothing will gonna happen if you nothing good will happen if you pass me, Eddie. Yeah. You're probably right about that. Dice set to six. It's not bad. Advance to the next gate. I want to. Once you pay my tolls, land on my land, please. Land on my land. I have some of that green org. <clears throat> I need some more territory here. Yeah, I only have, what, the, one territory? Yuma has three territories, looks like, so far. It's your turn. Ooh, Holy Banishment, nice. Five. Ooh! Yes. Red Orc's probably the best to summon here. So, our first multicolor land title so far. That's pretty cool for this map. You're gonna level up here, Yuma. <laughs> Skeletons. <clears> the <throat> four. I like the little branch there in the map board, it's pretty cool. Alright, so Yuma has this it's chain of yellow turn. three. So this returns target creature to accept his hands. Alright, so yeah, we'll use it. Uh, wants us to go with that one, though. Uh, that would remove one of their chains, of course. Down to two now. So see ya. Yeah, three chain down to two, which is good. Advance to the next gate. Let's see. We're gonna have a battle here, it looks like. We Do we have any, uh, we have a magma hammer? We also have some uh, chain mail, look like. He's toast with that magma hammer. The offense defeated the enemy. All right. Minotaur, that's mean. I'm gonna change too. I won't lose, not to Eddie. I don't want to lose. So the goal is 8,000. Three. 
heavy metal, um... Discard yeah, three of the same cards. cards. Goblin, three goblins, my gosh. I'll make you give up. Uh, it sucks when you have to sell territory to stay in the game. The game really changes then. <laughs> Alright, where are you going here, Jen? Minotaur. Oh, battle. Alright. Between Yuma and Jen, a battle. It's your turn. Oh, no, it wasn't. Some chain mail. Big roll. Four. Ooh, we can put some skeletons down here. Make sure the land level up or no? Next turn. The final gate awaits you. An org or a squareen down? I think it was a green org. Yeah, it looks like Yuma here and pretty much is our competition at the moment. Um, Jen, not so much right now, but uh, it could change. But let's take let's take Yuma down. A lot of territory. The final gate awaits you. You've earned I want to see Yuma and Jen battle it out and like clobber each other. Good luck on your next journey. All right, and their turn. All Discard right. your cards. Get rid of the. Uh, I'm gonna get rid of the skeleton. It's okay. your turn. Wall of stone. So we can use this. This is adds uh, dice three to the target scepter. Holy word three. So give Jen a three. And roll. All right, six. The final gate awaits you. Let's place down our wall of stone. We need a land level up here as well. Um, need some more funds. You've earned a reward. Yuma have, has a lead right on now. Your next journey. Advance to the next gate. 1368 for magic. 818 in spending points or spending money. Lizard man creature, that's pretty cool. I don't think I saw that card before, maybe once. Got it, I'm so glad. Hmm. More goblins, my gosh. Was it Jen that has all those goblins or had them? Or was it Yuma? Somebody had three goblins at one time. There's the three roll. There's a statue creature there, huh? We can defeat those. How many changes that? Two or three? It's your <clears throat> turn. Green org. Alright, six. Oh, cool, nice. Good luck on your next Let's journey. put... Okay, land level up. Level him up. Let me see. It's recommending over here, actually, yeah. My oh, lands grow ever stronger. Slowly. It's okay to go slowly. It is true. Yeah, they have all the goblin creatures. They have two yet. Yuma does. Stay on the water land. Can you place anything down? You could. Goblin. Chain of three. We need to take some of them out. Do we have any spells? I don't think we do. Do we have any armor? Advance to the next gate. Leveling up. Go to a two. My lands grow ever stronger. One to two. Yeah, I powered it up. Toll. Discard your cards. It's your turn. It's uh, getting a close match, actually. Um, you and I are pretty close, and Jen is catching up a little bit. Ooh, wind of hope. Wind of hope. Well, two cards from the book. We got the Gas Cloud and Fire. Alright. Seven. Advance to the next gate. Alright. Oh, we can place one down. 
Oh, no, we can't. Oh, we don't have any... I don't think we can put the fighter creature I think we could, but... My land we'll level up our, um... Our guy there. I like the music here. Pretty rad. Vacant land. Put your goblin. All these chains. Blitz Raven. It's a pretty cool card. We saw it before. I think we actually uh, crushed a Blitz Raven in battle at one episode. So which way are you gonna go? Oh, you lucky, Jen. You're so lucky. Landing there. I want to get some tolls from these people. Flogiston is a pretty common card. We've seen it a lot. Almost every episode. It's your turn. Okay. <laughs> Flogiston. Seven. So we're gonna have a battle here. Oh, that's actually my card. Um yep, yeah, right here. Alright, so ooh, we can place him down. Fly spell. Three dice on the next roll. Fly. Lucky. That's a big roll. Eleven. The final gate I got through two ga you. gates here with that one. You've Into an empty spot. Oh. Two gates and an empty spot with that roll. Good nice. Luck on your next journey. And just like yet yeah, that, Yuma is back in the lead. Level up, up to three. My lands grow ever stronger. They're growing wildflowers. All right, so mace. Five. Yeah, so don't forget, guys. The game does recommend you some moves. Um, but you don't have to go with those recommendations, of course. It says that usually it's a recommendation, but um, you may be able to do things uh, that will actually be better for you in the game that are not recommended. So keep that in mind. Cool. Seven. The final gate awaits you. Hmm. We could battle. But we have. He's pretty strong there. Oh, you know what? I'm feeling a battle. Dragon zombie, green ogre. And we can't use those. Oh darn! I thought we could. The battle was gone. Discard your cards. So I, I probably should do the land level up. There was a pretty even battle. Nobody won or lost, nobody draw, so. It's okay. He is weakened right now, though, so they pass the gate. Advance to the next Some gate. creatures don't actually um, recover when you pass gates either. Yeah, we probably should have land leveled up. Probably a mistake on my part. We'll see what we can do. Oof. They got a chain of four. Yikes. Are they gonna use a spell on me? Not yet, apparently. The final gate awaits you. Jen and Yuma here. And level up <clears throat> and take some toll. My lands grow ever stronger. Little skulls in there. Love little sprite animations. It's really cool. Hey, what are you doing? Discard your cards. We got three mace items. My gosh. It's your turn. All right, battle axe. Twelve. Nice. Twelve is really good. Good luck on your next journey. Advance to the next gate. Uh, so we go that way. It's my land there. That's fine. And let's level up. Let's do this one here. So. My lands grow ever stronger. 
Discard your cards. Um, let's get rid of this gas cloud. So Yumi here really is the competition at the moment. Jen, not so much, but keep an eye on both. Yuma has a lot of water territory and some earth or land territory. Ooh! Equal? That could battle me. Let me get a toll from them at least. I'm gonna level up. My land two, two here. Ever stronger. Give me that toll though. Good. Discard your cards. Two swords, two, two uh, for those. I'm the most motivated out of everybody. Oh, the cornfall creatures are back in this deck. Okay. They're so kind of uh, scary looking. <laughs> Somebody would see it at Halloween. Holy word, one. Ooh, they give me the one roll? No, they're gonna give it to Yuma. So it's really a battle between myself and Yuma at this moment. Jen's not really in it at the moment. But again, that could change, like I said. You've earned a reward. And you watch how, how fast it will change here. Range toward the, towards the halfway point of magic gold, 4,000, 8,000 to the full. next gate. <clears throat> you level up territories? Yeah. Go from. Ooh, a train change. That's a good idea, actually. Behold the true power of my land. It's your turn. We should probably think about doing that. We have a uh, multicolored train as well at the moment. I think we do. There's 12! Wow! The it's two 12s in a row. You. Ooh! He's fatigued still, so we can we can battle this guy and get rid of him. Green ogre. And use the battle axe. So he was down only to 20. Back to 50. Battle axe took him right out. The offense defeated the enemy. Nice. Fighter, that's mean. That was big. That was really big. Wall of ice. Alright, so yeah, we'd have to human back a little bit. But um it's not over. Never exchange creature. The Amazon creature there instead. Hmm. The right creature in the right place. Yuma still has a lot of um, spending here. What, 1267, only have 491, so as far as currency goes. Which way are you gonna go? To the empty space. You're lucky, Jen, to get in that empty space all by itself. The map's getting so full, and you're getting into empty spaces now. It's almost impossible. Wow. It's your so turn. Jen now is starting to come back on Yuma. Some scale armor, good. Six. You've earned a reward. Good luck on your next journey. Oh, we're gonna level up. Let's level up that one. See here. Do a terrain change. Behold the true power of my land. Because that was a multicolored terrain, so. I'm right behind you. What are you going to do about it? Hmm. Going to keep forging ahead. That's my goal. Seven. The final gate awaits you. To an empty space again. They put the uh, screen there, yeah. Chain, maybe so. Close battle here, guys. Ten. The final gate awaits you. What's gonna happen? A battle? They could. They're going to. Even though they had the down arrow of we have the advantage, but still, you never know with items here. We're gonna use armor. It's probably the best. We can use scale armor too. 
Use more gold though. Um, we have two. Let's use one of these. We have two of them, so. That was good because doubled our HP there from the defense was 40 to 80, strong. and I did 40 in damage, so it's your that was good. Turn. Two important battles. Mana spell, nice. Mana. Yes, we're gonna use this. That's big. Three. Advance to the next Ooh, gate. Can we put somebody down here, please? Yes. No, we can't. Um, we could. I think we should really level up too. My Level five. Oh my! Stronger. He's strong there. The lizard man. You've earned a reward. Good luck on your next journey. All right, Yuma's on Gen Space will be a battle. No. So guys, we're nearing this 8,000 gold. My lands you do hit the 8,000 uh, goal for magic, you do have to get to a gate. Discard so there's still time stuff can happen between that goal, obtaining it, and also getting to the gate. So be very careful and keep that in mind. <laughs> You've wow. earned a reward. Alright, so Jen's still back, backing off a little bit here. Good luck um, on your Yuma. next journey. Yuma is still the competitor at the moment. But again, anybody's game. The Cornfolk creatures. I never had those myself, I don't think. So I got a chain of three there. That's pretty it's strong. Shatter spell. User selects an item or spell card from the target and the okay, cool, and destroys it. Nice. That's good to have. a card next time that spell. Nearing 6,000 for magic. Advance to the next gate. You may be lucky to land on your own territory. I'm worried about them getting a bunch more of the water territory. My lands just, grow ever have a lot stronger. of them right now. Discard your cards. Two statue creatures getting the one. Oh man, just you watch. Are they going to do this for me? The spell card? They give me a three, aren't they? Give it to, um... Holy Yuma. Word three. Give it to Yuma. Ooh. Jen and Yuma here are doing spells on each other, not me, for the most part. Am I lucky or what? Advance to the next gate. Leveling up their cornfolk land. My lands grow two. ever stronger. I'm surprised they didn't go up to level three there. It's your turn. Being a little bit conservative, I think. Undying creature, nice. No spell. The final gate awaits you. All right, level up. Um, once this one here, it's big. Are we gonna exchange a creature too? That's right. Um, so this guy's a lot stronger. Put him there, the dragon right zombie. In the right place. Discard your cards. And your inventory. Six thousand. It's getting heated here. So lucky to land right next to her on an empty, vacated space. And they got some creatures put down there too. Wow, they got a lot of water land here. Wall of ice. I'm a bit concerned by that. They got a big chain there. Wow. We're in trouble when it comes to Yuma right now. Are they gonna use this on me? Let's see if they use it on me this time. The Yuma again! Wow, okay. Thank you. I'll take that. 
what a board. Look at this map. Ooh, you're gonna fight me? You're gonna try to with a Blitz Raven? They're so weak. Unless you have like some kind of good spell. Loki's gone. I'm gonna use my armor. Fifty. Oh man. But a Blitz Raven is pretty weak. The defense was too strong. It's nice. your turn. Giant eel. <laughs> I think we have one of those cards in our deck. In our book. Eight. You've earned a reward. Good luck on your next journey. Can we fight them? Um giant eel. Let's see something here. Um I guess we'll level up. Let's see here. <sighs> My lands yeah. grow ever stronger. Give him a toll. You must still have a lot of um, currency. Fighter creature. Yeah, battle probably wouldn't have been a good idea there. You're going to see a lot more battles here, though, where tolls being taken. Because the board is almost entirely filled. Only about 1,300 away from the blue. Fighter, corn folk. Fighter versus corn folk. Pretty even here. Magma hammer. No, they're not using it. They're using a mace. And armor. Ooh. It's a little sturdy, though. The battle was strong. Alright, pretty much even battle there. Boom, I hit back. Why, thank you. Yuma's gonna make fun of me again. They have two magma hammers. The final gate awaits you. Alright. So Jen is still holding to the third place there. 35, 54 for magic. Yuma at 45, 76. Watch him go three, yeah. My they mean business now. Ever stronger. Gonna set traps there. It's your turn. Come on. Pull this in. Seven. Advance to the next gate. Oh, all right. So we're going to level up uh, this guy. Two, put three. My lambs yeah, are ever stronger. Take a lot more Discard currency. your cards. And... This is a good... Giant Eel is pretty strong, but... Seventy-two! Wow, we're so close, guys. This round will do it. Let's see what happens. Ooh, a mana spell. Oh, they're lucky. Mana. mana spell. Wow. <clears throat> Come on, land on my territory. That's gems, I think. Level up the Amazonian land. My lands grow Two. ever stronger. Don't think I'm just an ordinary girl. <laughs> Alright, let's see if they use this card on me. Or for themselves. Six. You've earned a reward. So look at Jen here. Um getting closer to Yuma now. Good luck on your next journey. Advance to the next gate. Curious to see the stats, the graph at the end of this battle. I'm gonna level up. Chain of six. My pretty lands good. Grow ever stronger. It's your turn. Level three there. No screen. Eight. This is the battle here. Well, uh. Squeeze. Blitz Raven. Against a Blitz Raven. 
so I can use the Flogiston here. 30 down. What's the Flogiston going to do on me? Oh, wow. That was pretty good. So we had the Flogiston with us, too. That was pretty interesting. I'm right behind you. What are you going to do about it? Well, we're going to get to hopefully win here. We're at 75.92. I sense some more battles coming. Chain five. They're going to exchange creatures. Putting the fighter down? No, they're putting Lizard Man there. Ooh, he's pretty tough. He attacks first. Too. The right creature in the right place. Discard your cards. Get rid of the goblins. All right, Jen, your turn. You're in last place. You've been in last place for most of the game. Not the entire game. Are they going to use them themselves, or me, or you know? Holy work six. Themselves. Wow, really? You can get to the empty space? Wow. Look. Vacant land. I think put a skeleton there, yeah. That's a little bit of luck. Landing on the empty vacated space. Look at the entire map, it's full. It's almost. your turn. Long sword. Let's get to 8,000 here in magic. Come on. The final gate awaits you. So we're gonna level up. Our Fluxton. On his land. My lands grow ever stronger. We've made it to 8,000. Have to get to the next gate. We're only one roll away from that. Mana. But what will happen here in this turn for them to? We need to do everything they can to prevent me from doing it. You've earned a reward. All right. Good luck on your next journey. Here we go. This could be it. Could be a battle. No, they're not gonna battle me. They give me a toll. I'm surprised they could battle me. My lands but, uh, grow ever stronger. Wasn't in the cards, so to speak. All right, Jen. Thanks for the training, Eddie and you. Oh, I guess you haven't won yet. Not yet. We're close. Very, very close. Here's the battle. <clears throat> Against Yuma. Goblin. Two goblins going at it too. Somebody has magma hammers, I see. Oh, he's dosed. He's done with. Boom! Uh, magma hammer right away. That did it right there. I couldn't do anything to the goblin. You're right. It's your turn. Mana! We'll use that right now. It'll help us out. Mana. Nice. You've earned a there we go. You are the winner All right, we won. This war. Good battle. Really, Yuma there was a little bit of tough competition early on. We won some good battles. We got really strong there, so that was good. Stop it, Jen. It's not good to trust people so easily. Just because someone's strong doesn't mean they're a good person. Dot, dot, dot. Haha, <laughs> don't take it personally, Eddie. Yuma's still being just cautious. Oh, are you finished training? We should get ready. It's about time for Leech to arrive at the gate. Let's all assemble now. You're right. We have to make sure we aren't late. As soon as the card appears in this room, it's time for us to depart. Departure time. The beginning of our journey. Seeing the world beyond the wall for the very first time. I probably came here from outside. Does that mean my memories are out there too? Could be. The card should have shown up by now, right? It seems a bit late. Maybe she's stopping somewhere along the way. <gasps> Is that it? The card's here! Watch me a different card. Alright, let's go! Everyone, to the gate of Karana! Oh, wait, hold on, this... You missed something that matter? That's the wrong card. Hmm, this... 
The picture on the card is different. This isn't the card of hope, it's... Ooh. Blackout, the card of darkness. Blackout, what's going on? Why would she send a card but with the complete opposite meaning from hope? Does it mean to hide ourselves in the darkness? Maybe something happened to Alicia. The true winner is determined. Wow. So as the story continues here, we didn't um, expect that card to appear. So something happened to Alicia along the way. So I think I'm going to be saving her maybe in the next part of the story. We'll see. But pretty good match there halfway through. Pretty even. Um, I took it over there the last, three quarter, or last quarter or so. Last third of the match. Awesome. So we got some GP here. Ninja. We got a new ninja card. Battering Ram. Battering Ram. Drain Magic. Drain Magic. Spike Shield. Spike Shield. Shadow Blaze. Shadow Blaze. All of these new cards, guys. Which we can um, add into our book and make a new book if we want to. That's really cool. That's cool. I like the way they look. It's awesome. Alright, so maybe next episode we'll go edit our book and add these new cards into a pack. We also have some personal points gained, plus um, the GP from winning. And we unlocked Alicia. We can call Alicia to a match. Yuma has been unlocked. Jen has been unlocked. Solo match unlocked. Local match unlocked. Internet unlocked. Change avatar unlocked. Very cool. Ugh, so powerful. But why are you here? Terramire? Fool, did you really think that I wouldn't notice your little scheme? Alicia, leader of the Free Bats, I expect you to be quite the fighter, but it seems this is your limit. Much obliged, Terramire. Sorry I wasn't able to help none. It's fine, the gate has been protected. This woman has no more strength left to fight. She will soon disappear. I'm sorry, everyone. I'm sorry I couldn't take you to your utopia. Please live. Even if it's just for just one of you to find happiness. Whoa. Is she gone? A wish on the wind with your final breath, huh, lady? That ain't gonna help no one. Useless. Feelings alone change nothing. More importantly, Nighthawk, I have a new command for you. What? Or whatever you say, sir. The leader of the Free Bats is dead, meaning all that is left is disorganized rabble. Don't let a single one live. Take care of them all. You got it. Just leave them all um, small fry to me. Not a single soul can leave the city of Selfas. Not one step. Go and teach them. There is no utopia for them outside these walls. So Alicia is apparently dead. Wow. Sheesh, that Terramire. He ain't no joke. Putting out such magic made my hair stand on end. Anywho, hee-haw. So we get ourselves a headless bat. Those rebels got one foot in the grave already. They're all just going to die. Every last one of them. Just going to turn to dust and blow away. like Clint Eastwood a little bit, didn't he? <laughs> Very pretty landscape. Epic music. Alicia is dead, uh, apparently. It is said that long ago, the gates stood open, and beyond them lay a land of freedom. However, the Count who ruled over the city had them sealed tightly shut. Cool cutscene. The gates stayed shut for many a moment. Many people's lives were spent. Without a glimpse of the truth, much less a taste of food.
possible. <clears throat> Drifter of the city. New quest unlocked. With their leader lost, can the free bats survive? Card set. Drifter of the city. Cards with new abilities will appear in this card pack. Penetrates. Ignores land effect when damaging the enemy. Instant death. Defeats the opponent regardless of HP. Wow. Anti-spell. Cannot be targeted by spells or territory abilities that target only one creature. Boost. When placed, raises the ST and or HP of all creatures that meet certain conditions. There we go. So Awakening and the Rebels is all clear, guys. And next we'll be going into the Drifter of the City. We have a bunch of new cards uh, that we received from completing the Rebels, plus some new cards through our uh, new deck, actually, before going and starting the Drifter of the City quest the next time. And we also have some GP, which we can spend on new cards, so we can make some new books up. Um, I'm pretty excited about this. So make sure you guys blast the like button for me, comment and subscribe. I'm Ed Ray for NintendoChitChat.com. See you guys right back here next time. Bye, everybody.